Nick Slavic's customer had a challenge for him. Take a brand new cabin and make it look like it's been nestled in the north woods of Minnesota for the last hundred years. Everything about this house is compact, quality, handmade, crafted. It's just a beautiful, beautiful house and it aligned directly with the core values of my business where I love to take everything that was good for the last 200 years in the painting and decorating industry and combine it with the most technologically advanced coatings we have and then kind of marry those two so you get the best of both worlds. One unusual aspect of this job was the use of hand cut oak shakes on the exterior. Nick consulted with his Sherwin-Williams rep and they decided that duckback premium translucent wood finish would be perfect for this part of the job. I'm a huge fan of oils, especially outside for wood, and I wanted something that was a, a beautiful, thick, long-lasting finish up there because I didn't want the client to have to go up into northern Minnesota and spend his time at the cabin maintaining it. It's a two-step uh, oil process. It builds some coats. It looks like varnish. It's got a beautiful satiny finish. Uh, it's a little bit thicker product. You have to work it in a little bit, but once you seal those shakes up, that second coat goes on like just beautiful. It, it's so smooth and so good. and it, it's almost like varnishing a piece of furniture. It's, you see the depth of the wood, it makes it look like you, you took some care and applied some love to this stuff. Inside, Nick used emerald urethane trim enamel on doors and trim and cashmere interior acrylic latex on the walls. One of my, one of my favorite finishes is uh, Sherwin-Williams PVA primer. Uh, coupled with two coats of cashmere low luster interior for drywall. Um, I, I have a lot of satisfying finishes that I do inside outside wood finishes, but when I get a chance to put my hands on new drywall and see that whole process through between cleaning the drywall till it's just squeaky clean, getting PVA primer on it, sanding the PVA primer down, cleaning that again, and two coats of cashmere low luster, I, I would put that up against any new construction finish uh, general new construction finish out there today. It, it looks like hand finished plaster when it's done and that that aligned with the core values of you know not only my business but this project too of what can we do to make it look good minus a 30 step process you know in the standard prime it paint it twice thing how can we push this to a new lane. Nick had already tried emerald urethane trim enamel and was impressed with its shorter recoat time. One of the biggest benefits of the emerald urethane was we coated the entire millwork package, windows, doors, ceilings, beadboard, all the casing, all the baseboard, all the shoe, twice in a day. And with normal sort of uh, hybrids or oils, that is an impossibility. To save further time and travel expense, the painters camped out in the unfinished cabin. And we were able to sleep on the job site. You know, our heads were two feet away from it at night, double coated during the day, and it saved us a ton of time but we didn't sacrifice any quality. So uh, we had calculated up there um, that it probably saved us uh, five guys about a day and a half worth of time on this job site. So not only do you maintain your quality standards, I mean, that's tangible. <laughs> that's really tangible. Working with Sherwin Williams was another key to the success of this project. Obviously, when, when you want to do a showcase house, you want to pick a good partner for that. And you go to somebody who's got the logistics and the quality as well. Knowing that you have both of those um, tools at your, at your disposal, the logistics and the quality, is a wonderful thing. And I couldn't ask for a better partner on the project.